Welcome to this virtual tour of 22 Somewhere Street. This is a 360 degree 3D video, so if you are watching on a smartphone or a tablet, you can move your device around to view the whole scene in its entirety. If you have a virtual reality headset, pop your phone into the headset now and tap the VR icon to view the whole scene in 360 degree 3D. Also, at any time throughout this tour, if you look straight down, you can see a floor plan showing you exactly where you are on the property. This three bedroom semi-detached house is set in these lovely grounds, with a private front garden and a separate garden to the side, which we will have a look at in a moment. There is also a garage with driveway parking by the entrance to the property. So let's go inside and have a look around. The entrance hall has a door to the left leading to the living room, a downstairs toilet straight ahead, the kitchen to the right, and by the door, a cupboard and a cloakroom. Let's go into the living room. The living room has two bay windows and is finished in antique solid oak flooring, which continues through the house and up the stairs. In the back corner of the living room, there is a cupboard space that is under the stairs. Let's go through to the kitchen. The kitchen is the only part of the house that has not yet been modernised. However, it has all the fitted white goods and a dining area in the bay window to the front of the house. There is also a double door leading out into the rear garden. The rear garden is fairly large and mainly private, with little overlooking from the neighbouring property. The fencing has recently been renovated and there is a patio area in the corner. Let's go back in the house. and through the kitchen to the entrance hall. The solid oak flooring continues up the stairs and is an eye-catching feature of the house with the contrasting white fascia boards. Let's go upstairs. The top landing has an airing cupboard to the left, a family bathroom straight on, and three bedrooms. The third bedroom to the right of the stairs has been converted into an office. Let's have a look in there first. There is ample space in this room to convert it back into a single bedroom. However, in its current format, it provides a refreshing space for working at home. There is also loft access in this room. If you turn back towards the hallway, we will make our way to the final few rooms. Moving up the hallway, there are three doors to the main bedroom, the guest room, and a family bathroom. Let's have a look at the main bedroom next. This room benefits from two large fitted wardrobes with sliding mirrored doors. There is ample space for a double bed and bedside cabinets. The room also has an ensuite. The ensuite has an electric power shower and the usual wash facilities. Let's go back through the main bedroom to the guest room. The guest room also has ample space for a double bed and furniture. This is a light, airy room on the southern corner of the building. As with the main bedroom, it has windows looking out onto the private front garden. Finally, let's go back through the hall to the family bathroom. The family bathroom has a large bath and the usual wash facilities. That brings us to the end of this virtual tour. You can rewind and pause this video at any point, and then you can still look around the room with the video paused. To find out more about this property or to book a viewing, contact the agent on the screen now.